No matter how hard I try, I cannot contain my excitement. It is the Call of Duty dream that we have been waiting for, that I have been waiting for since 2016. Modern Warfare 2 Remastered is here and releasing next week on August 16th. Everybody knows that when it comes to Modern Warfare 2 Remastered, we had it right here in the palm of our hands, in the tip of our fingertips. It was right in front of us, but Activision, for whatever reason, multiple rumors decided to not release the multiplayer version of Modern Warfare 2. Now, there are many rumors that the multiplayer is actually finished. It's done somewhere on some hard drive, but they decided not to release it because they didn't want to split the player base. They didn't think it would be good enough blah 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 so many different rumors so a group of very talented individuals a group of very passionate individuals said you know what i'll do it myself and today august 2nd 2024 i have just gotten the early link to play h2m as they call it and i'm about to press launch game right now first reactions let's go i have been waiting years for this day look in the bottom right mw2 right there oh my god The sound. Oh my god. Just the main menu screen. I'm putting everything on extra. I need to see how beautiful this looks at first hand. For the people who are unaware of what exactly this is, this is on the Modern Warfare Remastered game. So you're gonna need Modern Warfare Remastered on Steam. You're gonna need to have it bought in order to play this because it's a mod for MWR. Drop a like if you guys wanna see me run up the content on Modern Warfare 2 Remastered and subscribe if you guys are new. This is early, early access. So I'm actually not playing against other people. Apparently, the bot servers are up, so we're going to get into that as well. But they did give me some sort of unlock all. Oh, my God. Let me go to the snipers. Oh, the intervention, the bear physical, and they even have the M40. All the attachments are right here. Camos. They got the OG MW2 camos and gold and diamond as well. And they also have custom camos. Are you kidding me? So they got solid color camos, polyatomic. Now nah, the teal looks so nice. Element. Stop. Stop. Ooh. Oh, my god. I got some nuke camos as well. Nuclear blue. Wait, is that a sore camo? Hey, shout out sore. Doomsday. Dear lord. I have to see how these look on the Barrett. <laughs> It's so beautiful. Jesus. Look, they even have the Modern Warfare Remastered melee weapons. You got a karambit, a hatchet, sickle, shovel, ice pick. You got the RPG handguns, all the secondary, spaz 12, all the way to the models, machine pistols. It's all here. Perks. Boom. Death streak. Oh my God. Painkiller is in here. That might be a problem. All the kill streaks are here. UAV, Harrier, Pavlo. Oh, look at the calling cards. Is that a Black Ops one? Black Ops 2, MW3. And they have all of these. Oh my God. This is so nice. Even the emblems as well. If we scroll over to the emblems, do they have the... I'm putting that one on right now. Oh my balls. And I just got word with low key, the coolest part of this entire MW2R mod, there is normal progression. So unlike every other client, you cannot load up the game for the first time and have everything unlocked. You actually have to unlock everything normally, like a normal COD. That is going to help the longevity so much. I'm screaming. Every Modern Warfare 2 map right in front of my eyeballs, including the DLC maps like Trailer Park and Storm. And they even have... Camp. Oh, I, I'm, I'm on my feet. MW2 campaign maps reimagined and restructured to be multiplayer maps as well. So you have the no Russian mission in multiplayer, Blizzard, one of the campaign missions, contingency, DC burning. I'm going to have to load into some of these maps here in a second. How many of these? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. They have nine Modern Warfare 2 campaign remastered maps in here. And then they also have every single COD 4 map in this as well. 54 maps on launch right away. Okay, I want to see some of these campaign remastered maps. So I'm going to go DC burning just right away. Look, even the loading screens, Team Deathmatch, DC burning. Oh my God. Team Deathmatch. I just got chills. Okay, this camo looks insane on this map. It almost looks like too bright, like some Black Ops 4 reactive camo type shit. But what in the world we are able to... Listen, I had some words. I don't have any words for this. I am actually speechless at how good this looks. I got to see how the Barrett looks. Dear Lord! This camo's insane! Can I weapon inspect too? They have their own weapon inspect... 
I can already tell the amount of work that has gone into this. These passionate developers, every single one of them should be given a million dollars for this. Are you kidding me? Hold up. Let me see what the inspect looks like for the intervention. Bro, they have weapon inspects for every single weapon. Okay, I need to see this FOV. Graphics, video, and I'm going to turn the FOV up. Oh my lord. I cannot even tell you how good this looks. Okay, I got to go to a different map. All right, let's do airport. This looks so sick. Look at the layout. <laughs> oh my god look right there right there is exactly where we came out of no way so this is going to be an actual playable map on multiplayer that is so sick oh bad memories where's the one guy i love lamp i love lamp i love lamp this is insane no way the The elevator works. Are you kidding me, bro? Holy shit. Oh, yikes. The dead bodies are still here. Unbelievable. I have no words. There's so much I want to do right now. Like, I want to see some of the MW2 maps. Hold up. Let's do Rust. Gotta see Rust. This is iconic. Also, give me the M40 on real quick. I, I gotta see how this M40 looks with some of these camos. I can't believe this, bro. Team deathmatch. Oh. <laughs> The music. The nostalgia in me is literally freaking out. Look at Rust, bro. Look at Rust. It's good to see. Wait, inspect for the MWR M40. Beautiful. This is the exact inspect from MWR. Okay, I just got word, which makes this game even crazier. There's bounces. If you jump on any curved slant thing, you can bounce. Oh my god! It gets even better. Bro, this is insane. That just adds a whole nother level to this game now. So even people that want to go for like speed runs and go for glitches and go for bounces. If you don't remember bounces, I feel bad for you. I wonder if I can hit the bounce from up here. This game is insane. Trick shotters, y'all are about to eat. Future me sliding on in while we're editing this to show you guys that the maps are actually being updated. So this is new footage that I just got from the developers. Take a look at the map difference on this game. So all the maps, all the gameplay you guys are going to see right now is actually old footage and the maps are going to be looking even better by the time this releases. Okay, so the next test we're going to try out. We've seen how it looks. I've seen how everything is. Now I want to see how good the controller support is. So I am using DS4 Windows and this is super important right here because it's all fun in games until your controller support just is absolutely garbage on these games and it just doesn't even feel good to play so this is going to be a huge test right here so i'm going to put all this up to unlimited right here while i'm at it i'm going to restrict painkiller marty dom and final stand so uh, none of these bots can outplay me how many bots can you even put it up to by the way 17 that's beautiful since i'm on shipment i'm just going to do 12 for right now and put them on recruit and i need to see how the intervention feels i, I need to see it i'm gonna go intervention bear 50 cal and m 40 right here please be good please be good so far the aim res like the response when i'm looking left to right feels really good oh my god wait look at the bot names fakey mw2 ghost toy soldier t martin j cap sidearms merc music it's a lobby full of legends Oh my god. The intervention feels incredible. And I'm trying so hard not to overly gas, but I mean this is this is literally my dream coming true right now. Hold up, I got to get a multi. I got to get a multi. Oh my god, it feels incredible. The satisfaction that just ran through my veins. I cannot believe how good the intervention feels. I, I actually can't. This is insane. So this was taken from MW2 Campaign Remastered. And they basically rebuilt the gun to make the animation insanely smooth. Because you guys know how it is when it comes to campaign. The mechanics are all different. I gotta try the Barrett now. Please feel good, please. Oh my god. Oh. I'm losing my mind. These sexy sons of bitches, they did it. They actually did it, bro. This feels fucking insane. I could sit here in this lobby all day. Oh, 
even the little knife. Yo, look at the headshot logo too. The headshot logo looks so nice. It's like so bright and stands out so much. Headshot clips are gonna look insane. Hold up, let me go to default FOV real quick. This default FOV actually looks so much better. This is what I'm used to right here. This is the OG FOV. This looks incredible. 240 hertz on these remastered maps with these remastered guns. It feels like I'm inside the game. It is so crystal clear and so smooth. Oh, it's... Look, it even says five multi in the top right too. So if you get like a five or a six multi, it literally pops up in the top right corner saying what kind of multi you got. I got to see terminal. I also want to see a different camo on the intervention. Dude, this one looks insane, man. All of these like reactive Black Ops 4 camos look absolutely outstanding. Let's do the gas one. Oh my God. We have never been more back ever. How in the world am I going to play any other video game until Black Ops 6 comes out? I could just sit in here and get my shot on all day. I hope everybody is able to try this out. I hope everybody is able to play this. This might be the best modded version of Call of Duty that we will ever have. I don't think it's going to get better than this. Let's go ACR. Red dot sight and silencer. Oh, this is going to tickle my nostalgia brain so hard. I'll even go with the lava camo on this as well. And I'm also going to go akimbo graficas. Oh my. Dude, look at high rise, man. It looks so much brighter. Oh my. Whoa! That is next level satisfying, that sound. That's on some OGMW2 shit. ACR red dot silencer. Oh my god. People are going to tear with this gun. I'm, I'm gonna call on the kill streaks right now. The animations even look so good calling in kill streaks. This is gonna be so good for literally every type of player. Whether you're a trick shotter, whether you're a sniper, or whether you're just a normal player, you just love using right guns and popping off and pub stomping like the old days. This is going to make every single community happy. Let's see how this is with high FOV too. Yo, look at the rap. We're so back. Pick up this UMP. Oh my. Oh, man. Like, literally, the HUD that we're looking at, everything was redesigned. The bottom left corner, the score limit, the ammo, the red dot. Look how the ammo is golden. It literally looks exactly like how this HUD would look if this game got officially remastered by Activision. I am so happy right now. It's actually ridiculous at how good this looks and, more importantly, how good it feels feels because i was a little bit worried because you guys know how it is when it comes to clients and modded versions of call of duty it kind of feels a little bit scuffed but this is like good like it feels like developers like actual paid developers made this game this has gotten me more hype than a lot of things in the past few years man so if you guys want to see more videos like this run that like button up comment down below i actually can't wait to play online in this it's it's gonna be insane how in the fuck are you about to say the way that we do it it's not the way no don't you swear that you not in the way nothing you do